Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here and for tuning in. I'm Valencia with Val 333 Tarot. And we're just going to jump in and see what's going on here with who you're dealing with. What are their true thoughts and intentions, uh, true thoughts and feelings and intentions towards you. This is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. Um, and I do offer same day personal readings for $20. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you. Okay, Taurus, so it looks like here that they start out just right away, just kind of cold and distant from you um, and thinking of some things, which is to be deceptive here towards you, just right away, just thinking, okay, and time to be deceptive towards Taurus. They're considering their options of figuring out what it is they need to do, maybe to like leave, travel, relocate um, for something for the sake of progression here. And then all of a sudden, something about that, that's where they want to get aggressive with you, mad at you, attack you, or just they're confused, you know, annoyed, angry. But then they're still willing to be kind of like they're loving, emotional, or friendly, or nurturing here with you and towards you and still plan with you in some way, shape, or form. Unless that's who they're hiding is who they're with. If they're having an affair and cheating on you, I don't know. And they're back to just showing themselves and showing work and business because now they're just focused on either their own career path, which they do well, money business, or this is what, you know, this is, the, they do this with you, right? Work with you in some way, shape or form. So they're focused on planning and creating, um, being very focused and independent at this time. At the same time, um, figuring some things out here with you, you know, playing the role that they have to play here, being with you in some way, shape or form. Um, Things are slow, but they're working, you know, they're building and creating. And this is where they kind of choose to remain kind of stuck and not reflect on something, some things here about something, you know, and it's in regards to either them just being really slow with approaching or them doing something or something is just not as, um, it's just kind of stagnant. It's not quick anymore, whatever that may be, but that's where they're just choosing to kind of just sit there and reflect on it and not really do much about it. Okay, now whatever it is that they are reflecting on, they immediately become guarded with you, defensive in a sense, and put their walls up and then they end up kind of planning and waiting being patient here with you and then wanting to kind of either maybe they're are they waiting to work with you and collab with you do business with you and or is are they waiting on what they do for work or who's at work i don't know but there's something about my, you know being focused right working hard building creating finances all of that that's what they're waiting on for some of you maybe they're waiting on the contract okay with you them and you but whatever it is here that's where there's a lot of passion so that's where there's like, you know, so whether, I don't know, either for some of you, they want, you know, they would love to work with you literally, you know what I mean? Others of you, it's like, I'm going to say they're, they're collaborating, they're doing their thing, you know, and they are, they still have passion for you and towards you no matter what, or that's where they're having their passionate encounters. Does that work? I don't know. Regardless, there's passion here that they feel for you or, you know, something going on in their life. And this is where they choose to basically... This is where it's interesting. This is where they choose to commit 
<laughs> or realize, oh crap, I am in a commitment <laughs> with Taurus. Oopsies. Right? Because right after that, literally with you and your energy, that's where they start a fight. That's where they're aggressive, bullying, angry. There's a lot of shit going on here with this person. So it's like they're passionate here with you and towards you. Right after that, they run into you and or it's like they're, they choose to be committed. They realize they want to be with you or they, you know, they're loyal and faithful all of a sudden. And then it's like after that, it's like it's a shit show and there's a lot going on here. Okay. Or their intuition's messing with them. Their gut feeling because they know the truth deep down, whatever it is. Like I said, for some of you, it's contract, whatever it is. But this is where they're, there's you know, argumentative or aggressive or frustrating energy on their end from them to you. Right, and that's where they get immediately then completely scared, worried, stuck, restricted trap bound they're freaking out they're going through it they're in shock okay um about whatever's happening in the situation and with you and towards you they can't seem to drop it and let go and now they're not happy they feel uncomfortable uncomfortable they feel kind of like bored stuck you know depressed miserable in the situation here you know with you unfortunately but in their own situation as well of what you know they got themselves into and there's a lot of pain they're having to go through emotionally, but that they're also hanging on to. But at the same time, that's what they're saying puts them in their strength or they feel good or they're just kind of like whatever about it. Like they don't care. They're just not going to care as much. I don't know. But they're still, they still feel like everything's great. Like things are, you know, solid between them and you or just this is, they just feel confident, right? And in their strength. I guess knowing all that's happening, but not really doing much about it. I don't know. Now, there, whatever's going on between the both of you, you guys are meant to be going through this, whether it's good or bad. There are a lot of changes happening here. It looks like they're trying to work with that with you and go, you know, either they want to go on their own new path, a new journey and beginning, or they're wanting to do this with you. Okay. Okay. Well, it looks like you're this new path and journey, you know, that they want, they're going on with themselves or with you. It immediately makes them realize that they need to not use you anymore financially, emotionally, energetically, physically, whatever it is, and walk away to manifest either a new connection with someone else or they, they know this, uh, but in order to create what they want in their life with or without you, they need to still choose you and stay with you. I don't know, either or here, okay? So something's still their emotional choice of what they want to do, whether it's, you know, that, like what I've listed, or, you know, they, there's something here about spiritual, for some of you, occult divinatory type stuff, or trying to study and figure things out of what to do about the both of you. Um, and that's just the path and journey they choose to go on and do and be, or it's being connect, choosing to stay connected to here with you, or, you know, maybe with someone else, either or, okay? You could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Thank you. Bye.